What's up everyone? Today we're taking a look at a piece of tech which makes growing plants super easy. It simplifies everything and pretty much does all the work for you. This is Botanium and it goes for a little over $70. So first off, before we get into the good stuff, yes, I know my plant isn't doing the best and it wasn't like this until recently which you'll see in a time lapse in just a bit. And this is due to a combination of things that are both my fault and the product's fault. So I usually have the plant sitting on a table near the window or something. But one day I put the plant out in direct sunlight for a good portion of the day, not thinking about how the plant should not be getting laser beam heat for that long and basically this made the plant super droopy, but he was still holding on. After that the device started leaking so all the water had disappeared and the plant then went without water for a little bit. The leaking has since stopped so I don't know what happened, but honestly I think this device is super cool. Also, here's a nice little time lapse of my plant growing, and it's been going for about almost six and a half months. The time lapse doesn't show 100% of the growth though, because I did stop taking pictures at some point, and uh, as well I chose to grow sweet banana peppers, but you could grow anything that'll fit in here. Put as simply as possible, this is how it works. Plant the seeds, fill up the thing with water plus nutrients, and Botanium will water them every day. Going a little more in depth, the first thing you do is wash off the substrate, and you can see that these are a bunch of pebbles instead of traditional dirt. These pebbles don't hold water, so the plant gets watered a few times every day, and the water drains back into the reservoir. After that, you want to bury the seeds under the substrate, and then you can go ahead and fill up the reservoir with water and add the included nutrient drops. You add a few drops per whole thing of water, and honestly, you barely ever have to refill this thing. Maybe about once every three or four weeks. After all that, really, you're done. Just set it in the windowsill, and watch it grow day by day. This was my first time ever growing an edible plant or any plant for that matter from seed to final product and honestly it felt pretty good to hold those peppers and eat them after watching them develop for so long. It was super exciting to check up on them every day or sometimes you're busy and you check back like a whole week later and there's a bunch of new growth. Seeing the first sprouts pop up from the substrate, the first flowers to bloom, the first pepper to start popping up, super interesting. And you can also buy a few different types of seeds from their website or you can just get your own from the store. They tend to be pretty cheap. Something I also really like about Botanium is the design. Its appearance is very clean and modern, so you don't have to worry about some ugly plant pot in your house. As well, this is the smoke white variant and it also comes in ash gray and laurel green. Overall, I think this thing is really neat. It's great if you want to grow a little bit of fresh food and want to just set it and forget it. No worrying about watering all the time. As well, I'm pretty sure that period of leaking is more or less an isolated incident, and who knows, maybe even my fault. If you're thinking about growing your own food or feel like you'd enjoy it, I would definitely urge you to go for it. There are obviously other ways of growing at home, so don't think you have to spend 70 plus on this to start, but this thing is definitely a very convenient option that I would recommend. Thanks for watching, the link to Botanium is in the description below. As well, don't forget to subscribe for more upcoming videos, and as always, I'll see you guys in the next one.